Hello wrestling fans and welcome to historic Fenway Park for wrestling all stars of New England brought to you by Bell Time Club and Dante Luna. My name is Drew Kazoo. I'm joined at this time by Joey Business and, and the, one the benevolent intelligent Donnie Wonderful out of Roxbury aka the six foot four tall on door. It's a pleasure to be here with both you. Well at least one, one of you gentlemen <laughs> Mr. Wonderful Joey Business you're here. Oh, of course Kazoo. Somebody you are here. Pays the bills. Yeah, well. I, uh, I heard that since you uh, since you couldn't be here in spirit, you showed up in person. Anyway, right. we're ready for a barn burner here. We got a match and a half on the way, folks. It's going to be a real treat. We've got the Devil's Reject, Brandon Webb taking on TRP champion and uh, local favorite here, Teddy Goods. Now, Teddy Goods is always about a good time. This guy's known worldwide, man. Everybody knows Teddy Goods, Brandon Webb, the Devil's Reject. Look at this. this Terrifying. This one's an absolute pleasure because I swear to God, these are two of the best that you're going to find in New England. So, I mean, this is going to be an eye fest. This is going to be as good as it gets here, folks. Oh, look at this. The fans are super into it now. Posing, showing the guns here. Let's see if Teddy Goods, see if the guns on Teddy Goods are enough to, uh, to help him score a victory here over one of the most feared competitors in New England, the Devil's Reject, Brandon Webb. You got to wonder if that's the Devil's Reject and he looks like that, how good must the oh, Devil's oh. favorite be? Wow. Are these the things that you ponder at night, uh, Joey? They are. I'm wondering. <laughs> they and are. if there are any more, I don't want to know what they are. As we see the Devil's Reject now playing mind games with TRP champion Teddy Goods. Oh, very Hey, hey. look at Whoa, whoa, whoa. Sliding in through the ring. How do you assault the help? Listen, I'll tell you right now, when you're the Devil's Reject, I guess you can assault anybody you want. Yeah, I think you get a free pass there, Kazoo. And here we go. Looks I like these men are about to stare down and do battle. Unbelievable. And there's the one gun salute, as you see there. I wonder who was the recipient of that. I hope it wasn't Wally. Oh, look at this. Teddy Goods now getting the Fenway faithful into this contest. All right. They're excited. I'm excited. You guys are excited. There's history in the air here today, guys. Am I right or wrong? Absolutely. You are 100% right. Absolutely. Again, these are two fan favorites. Very notable in the New England area. That's right. And now listen, you, you smell that? Fenway Franks, you know, the atmosphere. This is, usually, this is usually a baseball feeling, a feeling in the air. But we're not here for baseball. We're here for professional drop. wrestling. Into good the like headlock. That. Controlling the action here is Teddy Goods. Teddy Goods got the bridge on that side headlock Absolutely. there. Absolutely. And when you really grind that in, it cuts the circulation off to the brain, causing the conscience to leave. And that's the way you can get this match over early. He must have put that headlock on our friend Mr. Business here. That would explain a thing or two. As we see a shoulder tackle now, Teddy Goods. Putting the mustard on that one. Um, swinging him off the rope. Elbow, back elbow, so to speak. And he sends double reject outside the regroup. Uh, Brandon Webb used this opportunity to really collect himself. Well, see, you got to wonder now if he's collecting himself or if, again, if he's playing mind games. Brandon Webb is uh, no stranger to the squared circle. His uh, ring awareness, second to none. Got to wonder if he's playing with a good thing. Oh, look at this. He's nobody home. Nobody home, but not, not gonna, quite over there. We're going to play cat and mouse. A night, but you never turn your back on your, on your opponent. Look at this. Are we going to get a slugfest on the outside? Nice shot there. As you see the Fenway faithful taking a look at these two combatants now. What are we going to see here? He's got Brandon Webb draped up. Wait a minute. He's not going to. He's going to. The fans oh, now. Crawford, the fans now the helping Fenway in this match. Come on. Check that, man. This is Disgusting. You don't find that in this sport. This is the listen, this is wrestling all-stars. I mean, this is history in the making here, Mr. Business. Now it think, about, think about think about Oh vicious shot! My think goodness. About how over you have to be to get help from the fans. Over the faithful. There's oh. no Yankees here. Couldn't have said it any better myself here, Mr. Business. Look at this. Fenway Faithful loving this. As the fans should be ejected. I, I disagree with this wholly. You just took a masterpiece and threw an extra brush. Look. They're having a good time. We're all having a good time here. here Teddy go. Goods now. Corner to corner. Oh, look at it. We can get a monkey flip. Brandon Webb caught him. It looks like he's setting him back up. Turn about to fair play. Neither, solar plexus. neither combatant here yet to get uh, gain the full oh. advantage. Ooh, Enzigiri there on the top rope. Sends Goods crashing down to the mat. Neither man uh, yet to really gain full control of this contest. It's been back and forth since the outset. Absolutely. And... Uh, Looks like uh, Brandon Webb is now stalking what appears to be his prey, which is Teddy Goods, with a great, or should I say good. Oh, look at oh, this. Up and over. Teddy Goods now off the ropes. Oh, and he's got a kick right to the mush for his Webb efforts. Walked right into a size 13. One, two, 
not definitely not going to put down the no, TRP champion yet. with a cover not like yet. that. Forearm smash to the face. Now, hey, listen, if you're ever in, uh, if you're ever in uh, New Bedford, if you're ever in, uh, oh, sorry, I was looking at New Bedford. Sorry, if you're ever in, oh, look at this, Irish whip into the corner now. Teddy, Teddy Goods with the monkey flip. He was looking for it before and he missed it. Brandon, Brandon Webb now Webb thinking he, oh, and he going right into the corner. Hey, uh, Drew Kazoo, I'm in New Bedford all the time. What do you mean? Is there any place I should be looking That's for? That's kind of random you would just bring up New Bedford like that out of nowhere. Hey, but let's speak in New Bedford if you're ever over there. And if you're a music lover or not, stop by Purchase Street Records and grab yourself some vinyl, some CDs, maybe even a cassette tape or two, some of your favorite music. Go on in there and spend a ton of money because it's a great place. As we see Teddy Goods up and over the top rope. Teddy Goods with a slap right out of New Bedford. Goodness gracious. Top rope now. TRP champion tones it. Oh! Missile drop kick. Beautiful missile drop kick. Much to the pleasure here of the Fenway faithful. As you see both men down on the mat. Once again, the swig guts and determination. Hey, and Drew Gordon. Kazoo, did that double drop kick make New Bedford proud, do you think? I would say that they definitely made New Bedford proud, for sure. The Devil's Reject is hearing music straight from Purchase Street. I'll tell you, if there's one place that's memorable, it's New Bedford. As we see an elbow smash into the corner here. Teddy Goods now getting the... Fenway faithful into this match, coast to coast again. Oh, another vicious elbow smash. Messing up the face paint of the Devil's Reject. Oh, he's calling for one more. Is this a mistake, Mr. Business? No, not at all. You just keep hitting them with everything you got. I mean, mess the face paint. Sorry, let me ask somebody who knows what they're talking about. Is this a mistake here, Mr. Wonderful? <laughs> Absolutely not. You Ducks the clothesline. Oh, and there's a knee. Sends Brandon Webb all the way out into the kid zone here. About to send you out to the kid zone, Kazoo. Who's childish? <laughs> childish, I say. Devil's reject see, now. Devil's reject. Brandon Webb getting a breather again. This is all tactics, all strategy. Get yourself nice and rehabilitated. Get back in the ring. Oh, really? Was that strategy working out that well for Brandon Webb? I think not. As the recipient of that suicide dive. Well, Teddy Goods looks like he's really feeding off the energy of the fans. I can tell you, when that adrenaline hits and you have a bunch of supporters around you, it can really support your cause. Yeah. He's looking to end this match, I can tell, as he goes upstairs to the heavens. Absolutely, Donnie, absolutely. But is Look. he going to fall from grace? And no. Oh, wait a minute. Caught in midair. Look at the, the strength. Oh, DVD. Death Valley driver. I, I, I was going to say DVD, but I like saying the, the whole thing. Did you? Should I have said DVD? I'm really sorry. Nonetheless, Teddy Goods now, the worst for wear, the recipient of that DVD or Death Valley. Oh, and there's the moonsault. Nobody home, though. Kick to the face. That's what's home. Ding dong. Ring One, the bell. two, three. No, that's only a count of two. Oh. That close, folks. That close. And Teddy Goods is furious. He can't believe it. I can't believe it. Mr. Wonderful can't believe it. That must be convenient amnesia. We're all not looking at the same thing. That was clearly a three count, ladies and gentlemen. I got to agree with Mr. Wonderful. That was a three count. Folks, for Joey Business and Donnie Wonderful, my name is Drew Kazoo. Thank you for watching Wrestling All-Stars in New England, presented by Belltime Club and Dante Luna.